getting to the nitty gritty of getting vaccines in place, inviting people, getting the population to be aware, is so, so, so huge. On April 26th, Ghana is going to introduce two new vaccines, pneumococcal vaccine and rotaviral vaccines. That is why right from the word go. They were wondering how can Ghana introduce two vaccines at once. If you want vaccine, it's not an easy task. In the meantime, people are dying. You and she has diarrhea, so I bought her in. So, Yarasana, I mean, pneumonia, diarrheal diseases have been one of the major reasons why children would die, which could have been prevented. So, why not tackle the two major killers at once? How do we make sure that we introduce these vaccines without any side problems? There's some danger if we don't train properly for health workers and all those who are going to use it. And then if we don't also communicate properly, people may be confused. Assuring the public that it's safe. There are a lot of myths associated with vaccines. Because of the fear of the unknown. Because there are two new vaccines, the coaching requirement really became more uh, huge than we expected. We still need more space. And the space they are going to occupy in the courtroom it's quite enormous. I tell you, the pressure is telling on almost all the workers. People are asking, can Ghana do it? It's possible. We have scheduled and we thought about it. There are plans to train staff. We have set up several committees that is overseeing the activities. We have a working group that is solely for communication. We have a working group that is solely for training. We have a working group that is looking at adverse events and then logistics so that we don't take anything to chance. All that they do now is to think, eat, drink new vaccines. And one of the things we need to do is educate people about the vaccine, the benefits, the possible side effects, so that all these myths will disappear. When my new baby is born, I'll make sure that he gets this new vaccine. Almost all the regions have had new courtrooms built. And this is where the vaccines, all vaccines will be kept very soon. We are going to pack all the vaccines accordingly. And so we felt so confident that we should be able to introduce additional vaccines that will save the life of our children. To even pave the way to see whether it can be done. It's challenging but not an impossibility. But we believe we can do it. The whole world is looking at up to us. Yes, eyes are on us. We know that we are going to meet the challenge.